everyone, I'm Master Yanxin from Kungfu.life. Today I would like to share with you the Kungfu movement called Wulong Panda. This movement is very important for foundations. It can be stretched, can be warm up, and can be useful as well. I'm going to show you how to do the Wulong Panda. So first you open your hands, start moving your right arm, move around and do it again. So you move the right arm, release the shoulder, and move. Okay, that's how to do the Wulong Panda. In the Kung Fu training, this movement is very important. It's to give you a coordination, stretch your shoulder, and release your shoulder. Okay, this is the, some examples. When you practice how to do it, so you start slowly, from your right arm first, Move the right arm slowly, move up, side. Make a whole arm circles. Focus on your right arm, turn all the way around. And stop there. And try it again. So move the right arm. Slowly. Keep your arm straight on the line. Turn your body, hold the thing in circles. And back. The reason we behind training on the wall is because that will help you move your arm, make your arm close to your body. Otherwise, you will be easily move the arm or other direction. So the important thing would be the arm close to your body all around, so that you can make it more faster. So do this again. So slowly move on, close the wall. Then you can feel the body being stretched. And say one, two, three, four, five. Once you master this movement at the right arm, then you try at the left arm. So on the side, one, two, Keep your arms straight turning and around. Okay, now you try to follow me. So open your arm here, start from right arm. One, two, three, four. Arms straight. Still focus your right arm. Keep arms straight on the line. Turn body around. Do one more time again. One, move your arm, up cut. Arms three, hold up body ten, arms three, and over. Do more quickly, follow me. Ready? One, and again, two, three. Okay, and also, it's, well, like, as I said, you stretch your body. When you move, can give you a coordination. And also, you can apply as Kung Fu defense movement. So if you use it for defense or attack, you just need to move your legs when you move your arm. Say, you move your arm, yes. this can be useful. Stand, yes. uh, this can use the arm, have more power to your fist. And you can spin, and you can spin, or you can spin. That's the idea for the Wurong Panda. Also, you can be applied for dancing as well. So for example, more beautifully, so you move the arm and turn it around, see? That will be become dancing. Yeah, that's all. I hope you get the movement. I hope that helps. Enjoy the day. I'll see you soon.